already, can you believe it, halfway through the year. It is the perfect time to reassess your financial goals and make adjustments. Mark Lampkin is here to break down how you can reevaluate your financial goals and ensure that you are on the track to success. Good to have you back, Mark. Happy 4th of July, I knew Claudia. It. Right, I said to uh, Grace, our producer, I'm like, what jacket do you think he's going to wear? And she said, 4th of July, fireworks it's jacket. It's got to be the 4th like, of July. Absolutely, right? I had to do it. And I know you guys like head down to the lake and have like a big uh, family get together, so you're ready we'll to go. We'll have 50 golf carts surrounding the lake oh house. God. I've got all kinds of fireworks, but here's the biggest fireworks. Two months, <laughs> Cruz <laughs> Thomas just, Lampkin will be oh announced to the my world, gosh. my first grandson. Yes. Well, I hope you come back in July with all your fingers. <laughs> From your all my digits, celebration, all my digits right? will be there. That's right. I feel like, I mean, this was like a really relevant topic because I, it, you know, in July, this is something personally I do. A lot of people that I know do this. It's taking a look to see, okay, am I on track for what I got to pay in taxes? Am I on track? Did I overspend? And you kind of have like five steps to kind of that you should like walk through right. to really see if you're on track. So you don't, I don't know. I think we get so comfortable that we start we start out in January saying I'm going to save, I'm going to watch. And by now it's like I'm searching mo you know, Greece, trips to Greece. <laughs> I can't afford you know, that. It's so. in the beginning of the year you're you're getting started and what do I need to do at the end of the year? It's Christmas or November, you're so busy. Yeah. This is a perfect time. Take a breath, sit down. These five topics are really, really good, and I promise you, you can make you some money. All right. First up uh, is rethink. Yeah. Just rethink your like rethink emergency, emergency reserves. reserves. Right. So you know, for a while there, I was on the I bonds, and at one yeah. point when I was on, they were paying 9.85 percent. They've dropped down in that four percent range. So let me give you an example. I had a client that was in and had like a two-year CD, and it was paying two percent. Well, I can get CDs right now at 5.2, 5.3%. .5 so it was worth taking the penalty and I made them an extra $500 in the same amount of time frame. There was a local bank here yesterday in the paper, 4.5% on a 12 month CD, no penalty to break it. So instead of those I-bonds, for the first time in 20 years, I'm on CDs and no penalty CDs. Wow. And then on bankrate.com, you can get four and a half percent savings account right now that are FDIC insured. That's so great. rethink those reserves. If you don't ask, rethink you won't reserves. get. Right. So make sure you go in person to your bank and make them match those rates for you. Right. And can you like do you, to make them match those rates? Do you quote bank rate? Do you quote? Do you find maybe another uh, like something that's proof from another bank it's, to say so and so is offering this? It's can better you? if it's local. If you okay. can get something from a local bank saying they're going to pay me this, and I've been here a while and I don't want to leave. They don't want to lose you as if you're a good client, right. a good depositor. Now, if you've got a lot of overdrafts or causing problems, they're <laughs> going to say, get out the door. <laughs> yeah. What about new net worth after 2022? What does that mean? Yeah, so the Vanguard said last year the average investor lost 27% of their net worth. Can you believe that? Oh it was a tough year. Yeah. So how can you get to where you want to be if That's you don't know where you're at? You can go to like mint.com or Susie Ormer or Dave Ramsey sites, and they've got free net worth sheets. And what I want you to do is just sit down, and if you haven't done it, just you need a starting point. How much home equity do you have? What's in your 401k, your investments, checking, savings, and just start tracking that. Yeah. And quarter over quarter, or every six months, where have you gained, where have you lost? And if you don't know how to fix it, then come find some money like me. Yeah. Or if you don't have to know where to get started, find somebody like me. Because if you don't track that year over year, you're never going to be financially independent or get where you want. So mm -hmm. take, take heed because you're going to see consistency of where you're gaining or losing. And that wherever you're losing consistently, you need some help. Yeah. So go find it. Um, what about credit cards? I mean, I know that you were really big on if you have a credit card transferred over to a 0% balance. I feel like we get to middle of the year again, and I think we've kind of loosened up and, and there could be too much on the credit card by now, right? 37 or $39 billion on credit cards right now, yeah. which is amazing to me. But guess with the That's Fed. That's how people are living, Mark. I, I'm It's convinced. crazy, especially I'm convinced. with this inflation. Mm -hmm. Well, speaking of inflation, the Fed has raised interest rates faster than any time in the last 75 years. The average credit card rate in America right now is the highest ever at 24%. 24%. So it's more important than ever. Those 0% balance transfers are still out there. Mm -hmm. Still use them. Transfer them every six months, every nine months, every 12 months. But don't pay 24%. Absolutely You'll not. never get them paid yeah. off. Rebalance your investments like your 401k. This 27%. Here's the, here's the shocker of the show. The bond market. That's supposed to be your safe money. Yeah. It was down 16%. The bond market, more than any time in the Great Depression, for the first time in 25 years, 
I'm using bonds for offense, not only defense. Mm -hmm. But you're buying them at a 100-year low, so you've got some defense that's in there. But over the next two to three years, Jerome Powell, the Federal Reserve, said they're going to start lowering rates after this year. When interest rates go down, bond prices go back up. So you got a really good chance to pick that 16% back up. There's no guarantees, but you can clip 4 or 5% coupons and pick that 16% back up. So in your 401k or your investments, make sure you've got that bond allocation. Don't avoid bonds right now. They could be a really good investment. Save you. Um, how do you, is it good to do a tax review like now? Tax yes. evasion and tax <laughs> avoidance. Tax <laughs> evasion puts you in prison. Tax avoidance is great. And if you're going before April 15th, you're here, see your CPA, they're pulling their hair out. They're yes. trying to just get your taxes done. Yeah. So go get an hour meeting with your tax professional and tax plan. Secure Act 2.0 is out, has a lot of tax goodies in there that mm -hmm. most people don't know about. Take this time to plan where your CPA can take the time. Look, bring your last two years of taxes. Heck, call me, bring them in to me. I can tell you, and I can show you where to specifically cut your taxes. Now's the time to do that, not in not January. Not in November or December, yeah, even. No, it's, too, it's late. too late. That's you right. You can only give so much in charitable right. contributions for the end of the year if that's your saving grace. You got it, you but do it now. Else, right? All right. Happy Fourth of July. Happy Fourth of July. Great to be back. Look at me. I need you to do this. I need to see all of them <laughs> when you come back. My son-in-law, my son-in-law, Josh. Josh Action is an Oklahoma <laughs> fireman. Okay. I'm putting him in charge well, of okay. Josh, you're in charge of lighting the fireworks. And send you back on the golf cart to enjoy with a <laughs> beverage in your hand. Mark, great to see Thank you. Thank you. Hey, to schedule your uh, consult with Mark, just head on over to lambkinwealth.com uh, or call the number on your screen and set up that mid-year review. We'll stay with